It's kind of like a nightmare that I can't wake from. A nervousness that's making me twitch. You're being a bit dramatic. Puffer jackets. Oh. Everywhere. Oh, it's the stuff of nightmares, Lucas. I'm trying to tell you this. You're the only person I know, other than Mikey, who doesn't wear a puffer jacket. No. There is nothing wrong with the puffer. They have a purpose. No, they need to be put down. No. If they were a species of animal, they'd be biting people on Gari and you're, we'd be euthanizing them. That's what would be happening. Your aversion to puffers is not normal. It's abnormal and it's weird. Now, we put you in a puffer last week to help you try and overcome your fear of the puffer jacket. I sent you out on a coffee run. You do actually look good in it. It was warm and comfy and your own girlfriend said she likes it. She referred to it as a, th- a cuddle from a thousand dead ducks. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now, as a vegetarian, I, vegan, feminist yeah. uh, activist over there, I would have thought you would have been okay with it and therefore anti-puffer. Don't but know no. how I feel about that. But, a thousand um, dead ducks. I'm going to find a way to change your mind before I leave. I promise you that. Right. Righto.